Hello. Hello, YouTube. It's been a busy day today with me moving and all the craziness in the skies. And it seems like these chemtrail planes come every few minutes. But, um, like you can see in the further one over there, I bound it. You know, I saw it coming. I prayed to the Heavenly Father and the True Son, Jesus Christ. And they stopped spraying. They just, their tails are cut off of them. Their wagon wheels are cut off. And they can't continue spraying the demons and the chemicals on the people below. <sighs> I came out to film because I was looking out my window and I saw that rainbow. And maybe about a week ago I filmed one that was so intense that, you know, it was just unbelievable. But so far it's not doing that. And then I'll just show you some of these demonic clouds with faces in them. Bye, 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 bye. Loose, 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 loose. Attack, 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 attack. Two. Uh, there's a skull right there. Two eyes, mouth, nose. Actually, the whole thing is a big face. Bye, 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 bye. Loose, 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 loose. Attack, 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 attack. My name is Demon again. She's in the name of Yeshua. I praise your glorious name. <sighs> he's going to be tired of hearing me pray. I've been praying all day. This is just too many. There's too many. But I know that I'm protected. And I know that I'm helping to protect the people below. And I'm also helping to educate people on the fact that we do live in a spiritual realm. And that it is exactly as the Bible says. Um... The heavens and the earth. Satan is uh, the ruler of the skies. And, you know, he's manifesting himself lately with all these chemtrails that he's spraying on us. Um, there has been documentation, like I always say, you know, of, of strontium and barium and aluminum and, and lead and eradicated red blood cells, um, lithium, etc., that they find in the clean water streams of the mountains from the melting snow um, but not only is it uh, to poison people I think it has to do with um, it's spiritual warfare as well and I think the fact that a lot of people don't deny chemtrails do we see this animal right here one two a mouth a little nose like a deer Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer from hell um, I think the fact that some people don't see what we see, um, you wouldn't be on this channel if you weren't aware of chemtrails, you didn't accidentally click on chemtrails, and whether if you know that they're satanically inspired or not, you still are aware and you look up and you see and you know that the sky is unnatural and that these clouds have nothing to do with weather and maybe you've done research. Actually that's not a deer, it's a bafflement. That's the bafflement. I find you in the name of the show of bafflement. Anyway, um, the fact that some people don't acknowledge it or they refuse to acknowledge it, cognitive dissonance, or maybe there are spells that have to do with these chemtrails that if you don't have the Spirit of the Lord in you, that you are blinded like a deception and God does speak of sending a, a deception to people who don't have the Spirit of the Lord in, in them um, in revelations um, hopefully people will awaken to the fact that we do live on a flat earth and that the Jesuits have been uh, formulating a fake scenario of where we live to hide God from us saying that we're just one little tiny speck of blue dust orbiting a regular size mediocre sun in a, in a galaxy within millions and millions of galaxies traveling millions of miles an hour spinning on an axis I believed it for a long time and I actually just accidentally ran into flat earth and um, after doing some serious research letting go of my ego which I, I don't have an ego about science because I'm always trying to learn but what I'm realizing now is that science is really, it's, some of it is witchcraft. And it has nothing to do with real science. 
and the fact everyone just has the globe model ingrained in their in their in their being and they refuse to let it go when the fact is that there's no curvature there's no visible curvature there and do you ever feel yourself moving we're supposed to be spinning on the on our axis at um thousand miles an hour no it doesn't work like that there's no curvature i've taken pictures of clouds behind the moon and i have a, a, a video on my channel here that shows a blanket of clouds and a chemtrail lower and the sun hitting the chemtrail and leaving a shadow on the on the blanket of clouds meaning that the sun is lower and it's hitting the chemtrail and the chemtrail is leaving the shadow on the on the blanket of clouds that's higher than the sun the sun is local the moon is local too let me see if i can see because this is a demonic face right here but it's right in the sun and oh, i really i don't know if i'm going to be able to get it because i really can't see where that's a demonic face anyway i only preach from what i know but what i know and i feel in my heart it, that it's true like i i've had we uh sessions of weeping uh, knowing that uh that i've been lied to about the the you know the globe of earth and but also get it, gaining strength and faith in the heavenly creator and his true son jesus christ by knowing that he has created this for us and that we are special in his eyes and that there's not millions and billions of planets and aliens and all that no we he created this beautiful paradise that satan's trying to ruin and uh create you know satan's totally corrupted this place but he god created a safe haven for us to live and we live under a firmament under a dome and god sits right above us say hello hello yeshua hello yahuwah they're true it's true if you research fat earth you know, if you really go into it with an open mind and see all the deception and lies from nasa one and one equals two we live on a flat plane the, the whole globe spinning globe is a deception to take us farther away from our creator and like evolution that takes us farther away from our creator there's no such thing as monkey to man it's a lie too you know you'll find lots of lies if you look on the internet and you research um god will lead you that way you know and you'll be able to see deception too okay god bless everyone i just wanted to show you the skies and i got into that but i've been wanting to, dis to discuss flat earth with everyone um because it is true it is true that's why the moon right there that's why the moon is only half lit and the sun shining right there if the sun was reflecting off the moon it would be a full it would be fully lit this is, the moon is its own light source and if i had the right camera you could see that the moon is translucent like the white part of the moon that, that's the half of that's white the blue part is translucent it's the color of the sky from on the other side because it's translucent it's its own light source they travel around the flat plane making day and night and the months and years just like the bible says okay i'm talking too much god bless everyone treat each other the way you want to be treated love your brothers and sisters and walk in the spirit and the holy the holy spirit and the love and light of jesus christ